What is up, guys? Welcome back to the YouTube channel. So, 2020 has been a year. And you may have noticed that uploads on this channel have been a little bit slow or inconsistent. And there's a couple reasons for that. One, the Tasha's College of Everything review kind of burned me out. I published about 25 or so videos total on Tasha's College of Everything. And those were all done in about the course of three to four days. I don't think I've ever spent more time shooting and editing film than I have ever done on this channel before. So it took a lot out of me and I needed a little bit of a break. Two, I just got some surgery done on my head. Don't worry, I'm fine. I just need a little bit of time to recover for that too. So uploads have been a little bit slow recently. But the point of this video isn't to talk about the slow uploads or what happened recently, but to talk about the year as a whole for a review for this channel and for us as a Dungeons & Dragons community. So what did happen this year? Well, we got some really solid source books. We got our Mythic Odysseys of Theros, Explorer's Guide to Wildmount, and we capped off the entire year with probably one of the best source books we have ever received, Xanathar's Two Electric Boogaloo. As for me personally, the Tasha's College of Everything review is what took off this channel. We went from approximately 650 subscribers to now we're approaching almost 4,000. So I can't really thank you guys enough on that one. I started this channel in about early February, maybe late January with my very first video talking about why you should be playing D&D in 2021 or 2020. And in that video, I basically just gave over a couple reasons that were pretty obvious maybe a little bit vague and I stared uncomfortably into the camera way too long. That being said, it was the start of something great. And while 2020 has been a bit of a year for everybody, it definitely was the start of a hopefully very fruitful career for myself as a D&D YouTuber. Again, thanks to you guys. So with that, I want to look into the future and talk about 2021. What comes next for us in the Dungeons and Dragons community? and for this channel as a whole. Now, for us as a community, we don't really get to know that information. Wizards doesn't like to reveal things too early on, so the future of 5th edition as a whole, kind of up in the air for now. But for this channel, I do have a couple things I want to share with you guys. For starters, I have a content roadmap, which I'll be putting up on screen right now, talking about what kind of videos you're going to be seeing in the future. Now, a lot of this info is irrelevant to you guys, as I do make content elsewhere that is not just this D&D YouTube channel. But for the relevant parts of this content roadmap, you can see that there will be two videos a week, every week, starting in January. First one being a guaranteed once a week new addition to the Metamatics Monster Manual, which for you guys who aren't familiar, is the homebrew monster manual I am creating based off of video game characters made for D&D 5e. The other will be a video dedicated to something that I am ready to announce, which is D&D streams. You guys are probably wondering why every almost every video has one of these little uh, tags on it, taking you to my Twitch channel. And for those of you who've clicked on my Twitch channel, you may notice that there hasn't ever been any D&D content published there. So why do I keep linking it? Well. It's been a preparation for the announcement that I am going to start hosting weekly Dungeons & Dragons streams on Twitch. And these Dungeons & Dragons streams will be campaigns ran by myself for other Twitch streamers where the game can be directly influenced by you in the chat. So that's going to be a really big undertaking for myself next year. And there will be content on this YouTube channel to reflect things that happen on those streams. What exactly that is yet? Not ready to announce, but look forward to that coming soon. Now, for those of you who looked at this roadmap and a lot of you were here from my reviews, almost all of you were here from my Tasha's College and Everything review. So you're probably wondering where are the review videos? Well, fret not, the review videos are not going away. I still plan on doing full in-depth reviews of all official published material that comes out of Wizards of the Coast, be that Unearthed Arcana or source books. However, a lot of the unofficial material I review on this channel, your DMs Guild stuff mainly, will probably be going away for the foreseeable future. 
those videos don't do pretty well anyway and i feel like you guys don't really care about those reviews that much as a whole anyway and there's a lot more exciting projects i could be working on while i make those videos so tldr the review videos still going to be coming still going to be done as frequently as wizards throws out content for us to review but for the time in between each of those book review cycles there will be guaranteed metamagic's monster manual pages once a week on top of that being the new DD stream content that will be done and i'm sure you guys are going to love that so that's what you have to look forward to in 2021 this year we went from zero all the way to almost 4,000 subscribers on this youtube channel and i cannot be more excited to see what 2021 has in store for us i hope you're looking forward to it as much as i am so until then guys have fun stay safe and as always happy gaming